bell rock squished my boobers together smashing them together ow that really hurt these are the jazzy shoulders hello everyone and a happy super haul sunday hello hi i'm misha grimes and on sundays we do super duper hauls and this one it definitely is i've had a sneak peek at some of the items and i know you guys are gonna love them but okay this this braid i don't know if it looks like a chicken fillet or if it looks cute we're just gonna go with it but today's video is sponsored by fashion nova they are very kindly gifting me these items so i'm very excited to show you them it's such a sore throat so i really shouldn't be shouting but okay i'm actually wearing the first item which is this baby blue jumper i think this is so so cute and it's also really cozy like i have an old house so my house right now is freezing freezing i think hopefully you can guess what the silent word is or hopefully not guess what it is um but yeah it's so cold so that is actually why i'm sat down here and i'm going to show you the items and then try them on because i'm not going to lie to you guys i am too cold to stand up and get naked and keep on changing like talking and standing so i'm currently sat i'm gonna cover my legs in a onesie just to keep me warm because my toes feel like they're gonna fall off but yes this is the first jumper it's a really nice turtleneck i have noticed that some turtlenecks make you look like you've got a huge double chin if they're too tight because it's like that so i quite like how this one's got a loose neck because it doesn't mean that i look like i'm chinny mitchinison um it's got like holes in it but like i don't have a bra on right now and like you can't see my nip nips which is great um the lebs there's something not a leg that's something not a leave that is a arm length is nice and long it's nothing too short it covers my hand which i really like because it keeps me cozy also new nails higher higher than you can see but they look great um yeah this baby blue color blue we know i'm trying to get into baby blue so i thought this would be a perfect pick so yeah i'm obsessed with it also you could layer it with like a vest underneath a jumper underneath it could fit quite a lot um it's very cozy now next up I did, I'm not going to lie, get quite a lot of jumpers. You guys know I'm very picky with my jumpers. So if I see some that I like, I go ham. So I did pick up the exact jumper I've got on right now. But in the hot fuchsia pink. Because I just thought this was such a beautiful style jumper. This is in a size medium. I like to size up in my jumpers to make them really like oversized and snuggly. There's nothing worse than a jumper being like a tight fit. Because then you just kind of look like a pork sausage. Or at least in my experience then I look like a pork sausage. So yeah this is the beauty. This bright pink knitted number. I am obsessed with it. Um, and the knitwear on this one actually seems a little bit like the knit fabric is a little bit thicker so the holes are even less obvious but it's not as if the holes in this one are obvious i'm just picking that up but it might be just because i'm holding the whole thing rather than this one's like spread halfway across my body uh, but yeah liked it so much i got it in two colors so okay now there is one item that i thought oh this makes me think of christmasy and it's quite unmisha maybe i'll pick it up because i don't know if you guys saw my halloween post but me and kobe did one where i was in like underwear and he was like topless and then i did an individual one with me and i was like i'm such a confident person on the internet i will post in swimwear but for some reason there's like this filter against being an underwear and i find it quite silly because i am someone who thinks that swimwear and underwear is the exact same thing i know people like to sexualize underwear but to me you're showing the exact same parts of your body as you are in swimwear and i don't think it should be a sexualized thing so if i think that i think that i should then share that with you guys um and i picked up some cute underwear things um now i'm not really someone that wears cute underwear kobe will um agree with that my cute underwear goes as far as a two pound thong but i thought you know these are cute these are actually more like pajama underwear so this is the little bra top now i would wear this with like a black blazer or anything underneath just to like jazz it up this also gives me all the mrs claus vibes i think this is so cute and christmassy it's a really nice stretchy fabric the back band is really stretchy there is nothing worse because you guys know i don't wear bras very often than a really tight back band i absolutely hate it and then the pants are more like oh we've got some loose threads go away go away go away 
sticking to me are more like little girly boxers so they're like completely laced but then they have some coverage on the phalange bits um and i just thought these were really cute and i thought like i just thought it was really cute so i don't need to explain myself okay i've got this little set on and i'm not gonna lie this is so cute i feel like i'm wearing more clothes than i actually would in swimwear but this is adorable i need to tighten these straps because it's a little bit like loose on my boobs but look how cute sorry you can't really see my head but i don't want you to see too much of me so we're getting like a little cropped in version love these pants they are so comfy they're like not mega covered up on the bum but they are relatively this is so cute i just wish this was a little bit tighter on me but i don't really like it when it's like that because then it makes it look like a granny bra so maybe i just need to i don't know it just feels a little bit loosey-goosey but no, this is adorable. Like, this would be comfortable to actually wear as underwear. Maybe not the most subtle to wear underneath an outfit, especially not a white dress. But, you know, each to their own. I'm also absolutely freezing right now. So you guys better enjoy this all. <laughs> okay, I picked out those pieces. Um, and then Fashion Nova said, oh, we popped a few extra pieces in there for you. So... These are what they picked out for me. Now, these are very on me, and you guys will know that, but I'm kind of like, challenge yourself, Mish, go for it. So, <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Now, this is the bra. Now, I actually wore this when I was in Amsterdam with a black blazer and over the top even, not underneath, and I absolutely loved it. So, it's this black, like, lacy bra, and then it's got these, like, stringy bits. Then it has the matching pants, which are quite diddy, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um these are the pants and then that is the back so there's really not much back and then these which i think the technical term for them is like suspenders but i'm completely clueless so if i'm wrong i apologize but to me they kind of just remind me of like squidward and he's got like his little like tails or like the woman in monsters inc that's got the snake necklace i'm pretty sure you're supposed to wear this like here but we'll see when i try and put it on actually saying this chloe did wear this set for a photo on her instagram for her 20th birthday photo go and check that out i'll link her instagram down below because she looked spicy in this she looked insane hello again from a slightly different vibed next set so this is the slightly more sexual and skimpy number now this bra i absolutely love i think it is so so cute i love all this little detailing ow that really hurt um but no adorable it also doesn't flash your nips even though it's got this see-through bit the pants are very tiny i'm not gonna lie to you i'm not gonna show you the back because that is a bit too much and we can just envision what these are gonna look like on but i feel like that might be a step too far for me <laughs> but no this bra is really really cute i really really like it and then there's i mean you can kind of get the gist of what the back is like from there as well um but no really really cute i would wear this bra a lot fashionably rather than underwear -y. so yeah double use because i wouldn't wear it as underwear because i don't wear underwear like a bra because that is not the comfiest thing to do all day i don't know how people wear a bra all day i physically don't think i could do it but anyway yes very very cute but yes okay and then the final underwear set because apparently we're all about underwear is this one now this is attached so let's pull that out now again absolutely love these bras and i do think that's a thing like if you weren't necessarily the sort of person to wear this underwear as underwear which is me i will wear this underwear fashionably like this bra i would wear with like high-waisted bottoms um and wear it more like a top with like a blazer you know i love a blazer we know i love a blazer a blazer dress a blazer everything so this is the top and it's kind of reminding me of a dress that is it kim wore and it's in like that nude with like the black like rouging over the top um and then it has these little hook and eye details and i don't really like when you can see them but it actually looks really nice then it's got these black straps and it's just same at the back and then the pants are a similar thing with like the hook and eyes and then it actually has like suspenders attached and then it also has this like back bit do you think I'm absolutely clueless, but we'll find out when I put... Like, what do you do? Do you, like, open that and put something in it? I'm very innocent, as we know, so I don't really know what I'm doing. But they're cute, so we'll go with it. Okay, so in terms of the underwear sets, this one's probably my least 
favorite like the bra straps have come out too much from the side so like when i put them there like it's just all like falling down it doesn't look very flattering if they were coming from there and then i squished my boobers together and then it went like that i think that would be really nice but it's literally just so gapy on me like i could literally my boobs could fall out like look how like <laughs> it's, the straps are providing no support and then the pants aren't my favorite um i still think this is like cute maybe it's just not for my body shape but like look at this bra <laughs> this bra is just it's just there it's just there also if my boobs look huge that's because i am the one so that's why they're bigger because am i the only ones whose boobs like triple when they do their period i don't know what it is but literally they grow so much and kobe's always like uh hey and i'm like oh yeah don't worry there's a reason for that more baby blue now i have a very expensive jumper dress that looks the exact same as this and it blows my mind um because this is such a good dupe and i'm obsessed with it i say obsessed a lot i'm sorry but this is a baby blue puffy shouldered roll neck jumper dress that's knitted now i'm currently obsessed with the puffy shoulder like anything to do a drama around the shoulder i am all over it it is beautiful so this is like a little short jumper dress long sleeved and just a really cute number um these are really good to wear with like tights and high boots jackets you can wear it with heels in the evening or boots and like wellies or trainers or anything in the day just to casual it up and it's like a really good day to night piece and the stretch in the fabric feels great like it doesn't feel like it's going to overstretch and it makes you look blobby but it's also not too tight that you can see every single crevice but we will see when i pop this bad boy on now here we have this little blue number this is even nicer on than it is off look at these shoulders it is a little bit nippy i'm not gonna lie to you so i probably would need to wear like nipple covers or um a bra you know go there but these are the jazzy sh okay don't do that misha these are the jazzy shoulders um you can roll this neck like to whatever height you want it just to make it a little bit easier and then it's not like too short and you can pull it longer um but i quite like it when it's a little bit oh you know what it is sticking to i don't have any pants at the moment so i mean that's tmi but it's like the friction of like the prickles <laughs> too far misha too far but no i really really like this now i'm tempted to wear this tonight to date night i don't know what to wear too many options that I like, I like, I like, I like, Okay, going down a slightly more night time, I'm kind of tempted to wear this tonight, even though it's really overdressed where I'm going. But me and Kobe don't often go for like a dressy date night, and that's what we're doing tonight. So I'm kind of tempted to do this with one of the lace bras. <gasps> oh, I might do that. Check the gram to see. So this dress, the moment I saw it, I was like, wow, I need it. Now, all that, I'm not really that much of a little black dress girl. Like, I have some, but it has to be a lot for me to really like it. Like, it needs to be an extra little black dress it couldn't just be like an a-line dress this is a black velvet dress i don't know if you can fully see like the velvetness and then on the bottom of the sleeve there is this faux fur little trim which i think is so so cute um and then it's kind of in that style where like the dress is like tied in the center so it's got a low front v and then a little bit of a high slit on the leg but i hope this looks as good in my head in person as it does in my head um it's got a little zip down the side I just think this is so sassy and I am obsessed with it. Wow, Misha, learn some new words okay now i've got on this little black dress now the shape of the v is lovely the leg split is lovely the sleeves are gorgeous my only thing is i think i should have sized down it's quite like baggy around my waist so it's not like the most shapely i think it's because of the velvet fabric that like it's quite hangy but i just think it maybe needs like a belt or me to like cinch it in so it looks a little bit more like this but can we see how beautiful that then looks i just think i need something to cinch it a little bit because it's just a little bit like nunny without that but i do think if i popped a belt on or cinched it that would look stunning i'm trying to decide if it's too dressy to wear tonight or if i can work with it 
if I wore like knee high boots it'd make it more casual I'll find out but yeah still really really sassy I would maybe just size down when you get it um, just because obviously velvet isn't that much of a tight fabric that you could do with the extra little bit of like tightness you know what I mean? Okay, going back to my typical style, um, I got this bad boy. So, we all know that I absolutely love a tulle skirt. They're literally like my favourite thing. Um, so, I picked up this one because I don't have a nude tulle skirt. And wow, this is probably one of the best quality tulle skirts I've got. Actually, this definitely is. This feels really nice and thick and, like, well-made. So it's in this nudey, pinky shade, like a blush, because I definitely don't have one like this. I don't even look how cute it would look with my little bow scrunchie. Um, and, yeah, this is in a size small, and it's called the Tara Chul Midi Skirt. Um, so I do want to get some skirts like this that are short as well, but I'm obsessed with the midi skirt because it means you don't have to fake tan, you don't have to shave your legs. Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt, the world's your oyster. You can do whatever you fancy which is perfect and I just think this will be really really cute even if you took like one of the bra tops and wore it with a skirt like this like I feel like it makes the more sexy vibes make it a bit more cutesy and I like smashing those together <laughs> smashing them together and like mixing up styles maxi skirt Misha time so you guys will see this jumper in a few short moments but look how cute this little number is. You know I love me a tulle number. I just love the tulle fabric. I think it's beautiful. I want everything to be in tulle. Tulle dresses, tulle tops, tulle. I wouldn't say tulle. It's nice and stretchy, but the skirt's also got lining on underneath. Okay, and then a jumper that you could also wear with this skirt is this one. Now, this is probably my favourite. It is a little cropped number, or is it cropped? No, it's not cropped. It's just not extra long. Um, and it's got this v-neck and the knit of this is even nicer than the knit of this one this one is a nice knit but this one is a next level nice knit you know those cardigans that i was obsessed with that i'm still obsessed with that have like the big puffy sleeves this is a similar like can you see it's got the bobbles on the sleeves but it's got like an actual jumper with a v-neck the cream color oh this is absolutely beautiful i'm planning where i'm gonna wear this as an outfit because i really really need to with like some nude shoes oh just so expensive honestly these keep you so warm i'm absolutely in love with it not obsessed in love with it moving on to the jumper this is this little cozy number now i like to pull it as kind of like a bit of a one shoulder vibe but obviously you can just do it as a what would that even be called like a triangle neck i'm not sure but it looks really cute tucked into the skirt i'm literally obsessed with this look so wintry so adorable someone passed me a hot chocolate and put elf on i am so ready for the christmas season so lovely also really not see-through even though it's cream you can't see anything underneath that's what the back looks like really comfy not itchy as well we hate jumpers they're itchy this is not itchy okay another slightly less misha item but i really think i could start this up makes me think of the mean girls thing santa baby how wait what even is the song hey siri what's the song they sing in mean girls santa baby Sorry, I can only take that. Oh, uh, poo you, Siri. Jingle bell! Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell. Rock. That's what they do. Okay, yeah, so this skirt reminds me of that. I think it's just because of the noise it makes, because they definitely didn't wear... Did they wear leather skirts? They did wear leather skirts. But they're like... Oh, kind of similar to this. Okay, so this is a little pleather skirt from Fashion Nova. This is the baby girl... Baby girl vegan leather skirt, and it's just like a little floaty out. I don't know what the technical term is that. A line? I'm not sure. It's a bit creased, um, but obviously these like crinkles would fall out. I've just had it shoved in a box, so that is why. But even this again with one of the little bralettes would be so fetch. See what I did there? Ooh. Okay, so I'm gonna bring you down because I've got this little skirt on it now. It is quite short i'm not going to lie to you but it is really cute i have paired it with the little bra like in case you wanted to wear this as a look i do think i would prefer to wear something like covering the stomach area just because it is quite tight pvc it's not necessarily the most flattering across the stomach so like if i grabbed one of the jumpers and put that on 
I think it'd look cuter if the skirt bits were like sticking out underneath. But it is still a really, really cute skirt. It might be. I use a ring light filming and I feel like a ring light picks up on like food babies. But still very cute, very sweet. Um, it looks really, really small when you hold it in your hand. But it actually fit okay, which is fine. So there is space for more food in there. But yeah, it's just like quite a sultry little number. Okay, and then the final jumper piece that I picked up is a little knee, oh, pardon me, is a little neon number. Now I say little, it's definitely not little. This is one of those like full length cardigans. I don't actually think I own many of these, maybe like two, but they're really good when you're traveling. So this is a neon greeny yellow one. Um, and it's a similar knit to, it's kind of like a cross food between the cream and the blue and the pink. Um, but it's just like a full length knitted number. I thought with like grey tracksuits or like black trackies. It'd just be like a nice little spice up your life outfit moment. Sorry, I've got an itchy nose. So glamorous. Again, I would not wear these two together. But this shows you what the neon looks like. It's just like a really, really cosy number. Um, it's actually fit the blue shoulders in quite well, which surprises me. And it's nice and long. Like, it goes to, like, just before my ankle. But I just think with, like, joggers and something like that, this would be so cosy and something to spice up your life. Because we all know I'm obsessed with neon. I go from my stages... But I do think neon is very cool. And you know you see those Instagram cool girls that got like the really funky outfit pics at the airport. I feel like they'd be wearing something like this. Because you know they're cool and neon and funky. So that's exactly what we are today. Toodle pip. Anyway, so that is everything that I picked up from Fashion Nova. I will link the items down below. Thank you Fashion Nova for gifting me slash sponsoring this video. Yes, okay, so I'm going to wrap this bad boy up. I hope it's been a semi short and sweet one, but we all know I don't really do short and sweet. Apologies that I did not upload uh, my normal Tuesday and Thursday last week. It was just an absolutely mental week um, with the launch and with Amsterdam and with the event and everything but it was absolutely incredible so i just thought i would just do the one upload on the wednesday which was the vlog of my event and my shoot and everything like that so i hope you've seen it but yes so i'll be back to normal uploads next week and i've got very very exciting videos to come so i hope you enjoy those a lot but i'm going to wrap up this video now i'll link all the items down below as i said happy shopping on fashion nova i hope you guys liked the pieces <gasps> oh my god no 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 i just realized i forgot one huge item no, I forgot the blooming coat. How could I forget the coat? The Barney coat. Barney's purple, isn't he? So this is one of those full length, beautiful coats. I got this in a size medium and it literally looks like a little bear. Not a little bear, a very big fluffy bear. But let's pop that on as the final item. Okay, so I obviously would not wear this coat with this baby blue. I don't personally think it looks great together. But here is the coat. I feel so cosy. It's actually great. Now, I know this would not be for everyone because it is a very bright statement colour. But I think if you were to wear it with, like, all black or, like, all white, it would look really cool because it's kind of, like, a simple outfit with a really, really jazzy coat. But no so cozy so shaggy i love long coats in the winter i feel like when we were younger long coats were seen as being really unfashionable but now i'm like why wouldn't i wear a long coat a long coat means that i stay warm and it's great so yeah win win from me and then i can finally finish the video so to a bit guys i love you guys a lot and make sure this video like and subscribe and i will see you in the next video which will be on tuesday at 4 p.m so, bye. Mm -hmm. Bye bye.